Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Scalabro Country, the virus edition, a.k.a. the Pandy Pods. A.k.a. one salmon, couchy, two, two fans, fans of, of Fauci. Fauci. A.k.a. COVID's on the run. The Vax is our big gun with the Sklars to keep spirits high. We've somehow managed to get by. Old Z, Sarah D, TJ, and Shulman showed us the best side of being human. And even if daily Sklars go away, I'll still buy my next car at Dan Ford Chevrolet. There you go, Stephen Elton Elton Yates, Yates. Doing his the part joy to bring that he community together. I love it. Let's jump into a story because we have one right now. We love doing this for you guys. Let's do it. And here's the thing. The crazy thing is we still need to wear masks. Even if we're vaccinated. You by the still- way, I'm not against that. It's not hard for me. I already know how to do it. I'm it's okay with doing it for a little bit longer. It's just a good idea to mask up for yeah. a little bit longer. We yeah. still have people, we do, in our house who aren't My fully children. vaxxed. Okay, we need to protect them. So wear a mask. If you don't wear a mask or you forget one, I'm going to say this. Usually the place you're going has extras. Yes. If for some reason you're like, oh man, I, I can't go home. I got to, they usually have a mask for you. Okay. They will. You just have to want to wear it. Right. That's the thing. But if you're being an asshole, you're to just prove trying it, to prove your dumb point about how you don't have to wear one, you're going to look even more stupid. Yes. Like the dumb woman in this next story did. Mm-hmm. And yes, it is a story by the New York Post. So we offer as our standard trigger warning, our New York Post trigger warning. You're going to want to punch someone or something close to you when you hear something. This some is of not things. journalism. This is not journalism. This is just bad writing. Here we go. Okay. Don't get caught with your pants down unless you, are, of course, need a face mask and a jiffy. Shut up, New York God Post. Damn it. Shut New up. York Post. More like New York Roast, right? Oh, they got them. A, wo- a woman in South Africa. I love that this is happening down uh, mm, near down the under. Cape of Good Horn. Mm-hmm. The Horn of Good Hope. The Horn of the Cape of Good Hope or the Cape of Good Horn? The Horn of the Horn of Plenty on the Good Hope? I don't think it's the Cape of Good Hope Horns. Okay, so a woman in South Africa avoided getting thrown out of a pick and pay supermarket by using her panties as a mask. And I, I bet she really feels like she gamed the system. She on this beat one. the system on I that. I got one, right? you guys. She stuck it to the man by putting her own dirty underwear Ugh. over her nose and Ugh. mouth. You get them, lady. You definitely made them feel terrible about you putting your own dirty underwear on your own face. Stupid public point that nobody cares about. Yeah. First of all, you were technically masked up. Secondly, you put your own underwear that had been up your ass on your face. Mm -hmm. This is like a fraternity prank that people perpetrate on other people. But you did it to yourself. Right. And everyone's laughing at you and not with you. Let us get that out there right now. The only point that you made through this not is that it's not that the rule is dumb, it's that you are dumb. Smartphone camera footage obtained by Newsflash caught the bizarre interaction in which the store guard asked the massless woman who was waiting with their cart of groceries in the checkout line to put on a face mask. And it is the business's right to not tell her to do deal. that. Not a big deal. Totally within his rights. Especially now that coronavirus cases are spiking a little bit around the world. Mm. There's new variants and stuff. He's protecting the other patrons of the store, which is what security does. And this idiot, probably anti-vax, is like, mm-hmm. you can't tell me what to do. Of course she has a problem with it. Mm-hmm. And in classic Karen fashion, she thinks everyone else is going to be on her side. Like they can't wait to see how she gives this guy his comeuppance. Yeah. Here it comes. That's how much of a problem this woman is in her own family. Yes. That like she's created her own echo chamber of people who are like, I'd rather just agree with this bitch yeah. than tell her she's wrong because no. getting into a fight with her and like trying it. to, it's not worth it. It's not worth it. We have to live with her. Having no mask candy, the resourceful renegade. She's ob- not resourceful and she's not a renegade. Objects before pausing, presumably the moment of a light bulb went off in her head. No light bulb went off in her head. There's okay? no electricity in this woman's brain. Nothing is electric about her It was her like thinking. a lightning bug's ass above yeah. her head. You yeah. know, like something that kind of looks like a light, but then you look at it really close and you're like, that's just bright yellow paint. Mm-hmm. Right? Mm-hmm. So it kind of looks like an eye light, but it's not. Or like the... The eye of a child who, who who does not know better, the untrained eye that sees that. Mm-hmm. It's just an area painted. But make no mistake, there is no good idea swimming around this woman's cavernous brain. In the next moment, the cheeky customer, again, New York Post, shut up. Shut up. She's not a cheeky customer. You're just saying that because of her ass cheeks. Mm-hmm. Can be seen reaching beneath her paisley printed skirt, then pulling her black thong underwear down her legs and up to her face. Mm-hmm. This moment in front, like- Thong in, underwear, by the way, doesn't really give you the coverage. You, it's not exactly a surgical mask. I mean, it covered her a little bit. Kudos to her. Mm-hmm. I think this, even a broken clock is right twice a day. Am I right? Yeah. 
So I guess we should stand up and clap for that move. She did put something on. She didn't fight someone. Yeah, and she didn't. Yeah, she didn't start coughing in people's faces. So I guess on that spectrum of dumb behavior, She's, this is like the least, right? The least outwardly painful. I mean, the good news is she, it also kept other customers from having to look at her face. Well, and it also the second you pull your underwear off and hold it high in the air, that's going to give you the six foot social distancing you need. No one's going to want to be around that. No, no. So thank you for doing that, lady. Just that move alone was worth it to cover up her face. Mm-hmm. Then what'd she say? Happy, she says sarcastically. An astonished onlooker can also be heard uttering good Lord from behind the camera. Yeah, we are happy. Yeah. I am happy to watch you have to smell your own Literally ass. eat shit, you idiot. Mm-hmm. But also happy that you are covering your diseased riddled mouth, which is all we can assume mm-hmm. and knows with your disease riddled underwear. It's yeah. a disease for a disease. Way, I love way it. Way to not take the virus seriously, you dummy. Meanwhile, another shopper standing online directly behind the now pantsless woman encouraged the stunt. Mm-hmm. What This woman or that person, you got to get that. You got an accomplice now. Now you got an accomplice. Maybe you two can go on the road. You can be a comedy team, huh? You can be like a red light district tag team comedy. Mm-hmm. Like the, it's Syphil and Less show. It's like the Syphil and Less mm-hmm. show, right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Personally, I find it acceptable. It's a mask, she says. And quite frankly, I think the bacteria on your knickers is less than on your mask. Well, so now this person's all about the bacteria that's on your mask. Mm -hmm. I don't know. You don't know this woman's knickers. Mm -hmm. How do you know this woman's knickers? Look at her. You don't know this woman. By the way, you can wash your masks all the time, and you should. It's not like a hard thing to do. As long as that thong is not turned turned inside out, I guess I'm cool with it. She is wearing a mask. Well done to you, she adds with a congratulatory clap. It's not brilliant. No way. Don't encourage this woman, okay? There's nothing brilliant about it. Look, I don't know. Maybe she was being sarcastic and doesn't know how to be sarcastic. Doesn't know how to sound sarcastic. Being sarcastic is not an easy thing to do. Not everyone can pull it off. Maybe she has a problem with adding the sarcastic inflection in her tone. Like, that's something that the woman behind her, we don't know. She could just have a tremendous problem with that. She's like, I'm so sarcastic. And everyone's like, we don't, don't, you're not coming off like You have to do a better job of sounding like you're sarcastic. let's take a break. When we come back, We'll hear the rest of this crazy ass story. Uh, this is a dumb woman, and it's fun to send. Pull her off up. your underwear, stick it on your face. That's your mask. We'll be right back. Hey guys, welcome back to the show. Uh, May 22nd, Saturday night, live Dumb People Town, The Doughboys, music by Chris Thiele from from Nickel Nickel Creek, Creek. and live from here on NPR or Public Radio International. Love it. Get your tickets at eventbrite.com. It's going to be so much fun. We want to see you guys there. All right, last, when we uh, just took a break, we came back and it was a woman. A woman was asked to wear a mask. She reached down, pulled her thong underwear up, somewhere Cisco's heart fluttered, and covered her face with her own ass underwear. So this video got posted online. Of course, the internet critics weren't so impressed. Mm-hmm. Come on, grow up. What must your family think? Ask one, ask one Facebook user, mm-hmm. according to Newsflash. My guess is her family does not want to engage her, like we said before, ever, mm-hmm. okay? They don't want to ask her to do anything. What? This dinner smells weird? No, nobody said the dinner smells weird. Mm-hmm. Nobody, like, you know, she's like just bracing herself for a fight. She's in like, ever. tell me, let me go. Let me go at no this No one, one ever wants to like, Approach her for fear that she'll quote unquote do something. Mm-hmm. You, that's the thing that most people are afraid of with she's gonna do something. Mm-hmm. There are huge discussions in her family where people are like, don't make her do something. Just don't ask her to do anything. I'm pretty sure her family has seen this behavior before. Yeah, they this is not gonna be, be a surprise. This. this won't be a surprise. Like the time she sat on a Christmas tree because the kids weren't picking up the wrapping paper too quickly. Mm-hmm. Or the time she stuck an Easter egg up her butt because the dog wouldn't stop barking. That's not gonna make him stop. What does that have to do with the other? Add another, this makes me sick. She's aware of the law worldwide. We have a serious virus, and she thinks a G-string will save her. She doesn't think a G-string will save her. G-string, I mean, it might if she has to turn to stripping. I Maybe. I don't know. It's may, G-string diplomacy, maybe, mm-hmm. is what we could call this. That's yes. maybe the best phrase to come out of this whole story. You can't, you can't stop a global pandemic with a G-string. Am I right? You can't stop a global pandemic with G-string diplomacy. It ain't nothing but a G-string, baby. How come no one stepped in and said that? How, if you, if someone in South Africa, a white person said, ain't, ain't nothing, nothing but, but a G-string, G-string, baby, and Snoop found out about it. And he, got into it. He would get into it. He would get into it. He would, he would have gotten into it. He would have gotten close with the person who did that riff. 
Maybe it would have brought Snoop and Dre like back together again mm-hmm. to re-record that album. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ain't nothing but a G-string, baby. And she's Panty Face. She is Panty Face. Panty Face, that's her name. Panty that's her rap fa- name. It's like Baby Face. Right? She's Panty Face. She like, opens for Baby Face. She opens for Baby Face. She opens for Cardi B, Panty Face. And her big move is taking off her things, putting it on her face. Just the Ain't guy. nothing. And she does... She does G thing, but it's G string. G string baby, and she does her version of WAP. You cannot stop a global pandemic with a G string. You're gonna need a hell of a lot more coverage than that. Mm-hmm. I'm just gonna say this. Period. And there are moments when it feels like we're trying to stop this global pandemic with a G string. We need more coverage. That should be the actual phrase, guys. We're trying to stop a pandemic with, with a, a G string, string over here. Let's not gonna work. Let's mask up with some granny bloomers. There you go. There and that is. is a show. Guys, stay connected, stay protected, don't get infected. This is not a hoax. But we got the jokes. Wear a mask, get vaccinated, do all those wonderful things. We'll see you on May 22nd, Saturday night for the live Dumb People Town. And have a good one. We'll see you tomorrow. La-di-da. La-di-da-di-da-di-da.